is what it is it is your girl cadillac yes i'm cadillac dixon i'm the draw my life prison wife i'm the legally blind artist that is rapping and painting for justice hoping to see justice before i face too black yeah his see your girl cadillac anyways i do got some passengers riding with your girl all right y'all see miss princess <laughs> rocking her baby hair afro <laughs> hold up say hey Princess, is she princess, too what is she something? trying to get? I don't know. Mama, <laughs> say hey. <laughs> Money, say hey. Hey. Mama. Princess, <laughs> she mushed you in the face. What princess. Is issue? <laughs> anyway, princess, we got to be quiet now, hon. We, we finna record a video, okay? We got to be quiet. All right? Very quiet okay so we were going down memory lane y'all check out the last video where i was whooping isaiah tail my little nephew tail in basketball <laughs> y'all if y'all seen the video y'all know it didn't even happen like that but we gonna just leave it you know how people change the past have you ever talked to somebody and you know something happened a certain way but they say oh that ain't how that happened they changed the past so i'm changing the past on that i whooped his tail the hey. You quiet down now? That mama. Okay, y'all. Y'all ready to she record? She won't stop beating me up. <laughs> she kissing you. Yeah, now. She was just pulling my hair. Okay, so getting back to where we left off, um, it was the Roe Clawson challenge that um, me and Money did together. So I'm going to ask Money um, a few questions about that. So what do you remember about that challenge? We did that in 2020. Everything was shut down. Things was crazy. I remember I looked it crazy. <laughs> How you look crazy? I did. <laughs> Mama. Look. Okay, so we drew the frames. You you got your artist on because you were drawing frames too. Yeah. So did it like put you in an emotional state doing that? Like, um, basically in that video, you were releasing emotions. Like I was releasing emotions about being a prison wife. But a lot of times people don't care about that. But being a child of a prisoner, and you were releasing like, um, what were some of the things you touched on in that video? Oh, you ready? Yeah. Oh, okay. So what were some of the things you remember about recording that? So I remember how I said that he wasn't able to go to my birth, well, any of my birthdays, um, my graduation, no good night hugs or kisses, like, you know, how all my other friends had with their dads and stuff like that. So, yeah. So did, were you scared to do that like that? Cause a lot, that one got uh, quite a bit of views. Were you scared to like, basically like put that out in the world that. No. Cause don't nobody fear me. Put fear in my heart. <laughs> yeah. But exposing yourself. No, because anything that anybody could say, I've said to myself already. So I don't care. Okay, so we're going to move to the next video. Well, a lot of people love that video. Let me read a comment from it. All right, guys, I'm going to go drop my passengers off because baby is getting cranky and I'll come back and finish the video. All right. So I did get a comment from Miss Roclaus and she was able to see it. She put absolutely beautiful. You did such an amazing job. And then I have another... Um, comment from miss Catherine jewels jewels i'm sorry 8822 she was actually a part of the prison wives but she's a part of the prison wives now they're on the free world so they're no longer prison wives they were freed from that both of them yes and miss ro claus and her husband had 213 years and during 2020 he was actually released Yes, yeah, she had 200, well, her husband had 213 years, but she was ready to just ride the whole thing out with him. But there was something called, um, I believe it was First Step Act that was passed during that year, and he was released under that. And um, Catherine Jules, I'm not sure how her husband was released, but they're way past this prison wife life journey um, and helping others get through it as well. So the next video 
is the what is project reach the world this video oh my gosh so this said i released this two years ago it has 468 views i literally spent a full month doing this video creating this video um from the time that i released that row clausen challenge let me see will it tell me the date it just says two years ago so i'm not sure what month because it's just telling me all two years but it was like i released that one month and then months later i know in june i released this what is project reached the world that's when my channel officially relaunched in 2020 june 2020 um and I spent a full-fledged month. I wrote out every single thing about what is Project Reach the World because Project Reach the World is something that I have been doing for many years. It started in 2006 with meeting Mr. Life Jennings. Um, I met him. I got my artwork to him. Um, I did a poem for, poem for him called 1020 Life, and he gave me some advice. He gave me the advice that life is possible and to tell that man don't ever give up. Um, and before I met Mr. Life Jennings, I had a dream that I met him. But in the dream, we ended up making music together. That's when I was out there on my grind. And everything in the dream came about except for us making music together. So I was convinced that it maybe it wasn't Life Jennings. It must have been somebody else. So... I got on my grind making artwork for everybody, any and everybody. I started actually recording in a real studio and trying to obtain beats and this and that. And I really full heartedly started on my grind of trying to reach the world about Marcello Jackson being wrongfully convicted and excessively sentenced through means of all my art forms. This video shows everything i show my wild hair pieces i show my artwork i show my um all the famous famous people that i have gotten famous and not just famous um very relevant people that i have gotten my artwork to um it just has everything it shows everything my caricatures that i did for um, my fellow prison wives and it took me forever because I'm like, oh, I got to add this or oh, I got to add that. If y'all ever seen my Facebook, oh, I've been grinding for a long, long, long time. And you could just scroll and scroll and scroll. And it's a lot of things that I forget. I'm like, oh, I did that. Oh, I did that. Oh, I did. When you reflect back on how much I have literally done to try to bring this story about, it, it, it even amazes me um, because it, one, it's not my talent. It's a talent entrusted by me from God. Right. So it's so amazing. So it it's me seeing God's amazement when I look back over all these things I've done. Um, anyways, everybody has showed up um, for Thanksgiving dinner. So I'm sorry. I got to wrap this up again. Um, but we'll pick up right where we left off, but at least we got to spend a little time. Princess took most of the time cause she was up there whining and stuff <laughs> and I couldn't record while she was doing that. She was hungry. All right, guys, hiss your girl Cadillac. Enjoy your day, guys.